Let's try that. Just a smaller bridge tuber. Come on, baby, please. P fuck you. I hate you. I hate you, you fucking level. Can't get you out of my... How's it going everybody, Dragast here, and welcome back to some more Polybridge. So I am extremely excited, that is because we are finally starting Zen Gardens. Now if you don't know, this is the final level, or sorry, for the final map of the current version of the game, and I have been told by you guys there are some seriously difficult bridges in this world. So I'm excited to try them out, I'm actually kind of worried that we're not going to be able to complete them all, but I'm going to do my best. We haven't failed yet, so hopefully we can continue that. To start off with, we got Seesaw, so uh, 65,000, we can use, looks like everything, Surfer's Van, Large Paddle Boat, then Hydraulic Phase, Surfer's Van, and then Large Paddle Boat once again. Simple enough, basically we gotta get A to A and B to B and make some sort of teeter-totter bridge. Now that definitely isn't simple, so I don't even know where to start here. Obviously Obviously, let's just make a road all the way across. We're going to have to add split joints here because there's going to be a boat in the way if we don't do so. So we're going to have a split joint here and a split joint here. Perfect. Now I don't know what to do. <laughs> so we do have a lot of money to spend. For right now, I'm going to add this little thing here. That way it holds on to that middle island. I, got, I think I got to use that island as basically a pivoting point. Now I got to add hydraulics to the left and right. I have no idea how to begin with these hydraulics. Can I attach these? Sure, that seems like a good start. Now I have no idea what to do though. Okay, I'm just gonna try a triangle bridge here just to see what happens. Uh, I know this isn't going to work, obviously, because unfortunately hydraulics only contract to a maximum of 50%, meaning figuratively this bridge should make it to the where balance is right in the middle, but it won't go high enough to get B. Now let's try this out here. I don't even know if it's going to... Actually, it might work here, so we don't need to reinforce it that much, thankfully. These uh, vans are not that heavy. Now during this phase, I just want to see if this can kind of work... Oh, yeah, that's that's not good. Oh, great. Okay. I don't even know what's going on. Oh, wait, the boat's coming. <laughs> well, there's a dead van. Okay, so we have a lot of work to do, but at least the bridge is stable. I mean, that's amazing right, right, right off the bat. Okay, so I've been playing around with these uh, split joint numbers. I think I got it to the point where it will detach from each side now. But now I have a problem of, yes, the bridge actually breaking because there's no bend in it. So what I gotta do for this, I think, is just take out one of these beams. And that should be more than enough for each side. So we'll do that one and that one. And assuming this is structurally stable enough, it might actually bend now. Let's find out. Okay, yes, that's exactly what we want. And as I stated, it should be right in the middle because you can only contract it by 50%. So we gotta add one more hydraulic somewhere that will do the extra 50% essentially. So for this side, I wonder if I can just make this also a split joint and then add another hydraulic on top of the same size. Now that should perfectly lift it to the point where we need it. I just don't know how I'm supposed to really attach this to anything. So maybe if I can maybe put a steel beam here. Actually, maybe even cables might work. Let's try cables just for right now and uh, we'll see what happens here. Because <laughs> I have no idea what's going to happen. Let's try it out though. Okay, so there we go. That's good. And... Wow. Okay, interesting. Okay, so I've been tweaking this a bit. I don't really know how to use it with just hydraulics. I had to bank a steel structure here just to kind of understand it. Now, this should actually pull it all the way up 50%, and if my math is correct, it will be exactly where this van's supposed to go. We haven't done anything to the other side yet, so that's going to obviously not work, but this one, oh yes, look at that. But unfortunately, it breaks now. Why does it break? Why does... Why do you have to break? Okay, let's see what's actually making it break here. I don't know if it's stress or if the boat hit it. I didn't even pay attention to that, really. But, oh yeah, that's definitely... God damn it, the boat hitting it. So now I gotta figure out how to lift it even higher. I'm obviously just gonna have to play around with the road a little bit, I think. So if we lift all this up a little bit, hopefully it doesn't become extremely flimsy, because this is when it will. We'll see what happens there. So there's a little bit of a hump now. Let's see what happens. Speed that shit up. There we go. Oh, oh my god, the boat is still hitting it. What the fuck? This is a... The first one is pretty much telling me how difficult all the rest of these levels are going to be, because this is one of the hardest levels yet. Okay, let's try this out, see what happens. It's really high now, but it's still an extremely sturdy bridge. There we go. Oh my god. Now, I don't even know if that hit it or not. What the hell just happened? 
Okay, let's slow it down here and see what happens. Because there's a lot going on. It's hard to tell it all. Oh, yeah, that's just weight. Total weight issue. So maybe I can tweak this a little bit to reinforce it. Uh, I might have to put steel in here, though. Okay, just doing a few more tweaks here. That might be good right here. Oh, my God. Like, Look at how much this bridge has changed just by tweaking it. Okay, it's a bit rocky. Oh, we actually completed the level? Oh, my God. I... I didn't even think about that, but it can just fall down. Oh my, I feel like that's almost cheating, but holy crap, we are, this is officially the most in budget I've ever been, and it actually works. Interesting, I mean, it's not, I, would, I was hoping to actually build this so this side worked as well, but if it's going to fall on it and win for me, let's go on to the next one. That one was a success. God, I did not expect that success. <laughs> I was confused at why it said level complete. Anyways, let's go on. Oh, God, I don't like the sound of triple jump, especially when there's dump trucks. Great. Oh, do I just have to... I just have to make a jump. Okay, simple enough. I only got to jump fucking 10 tons of construction machinery. This is going to be great. All right, how much road do we have? That is the big question. We have unlimited road. Wait, what? I don't even... I'm confused now. Okay, so triple... Oh my god, I thought it said jump. It says dump. That explains a lot in my brain. Okay, so this isn't too bad. I just gotta make a really structurally stable bridge for a lot of freaking weight. And that is usually harder than it seems. Now, we only got steel, wood, and road. Now, I did use $52,000 right there. I wonder if I could just make... You know what? We're, we're gonna go for something here. So I've done this in the past where I actually made an arch bridge mixed with a triangle bridge, and it worked very well. I have no idea if it's gonna work here or not, but we're gonna try it out and see what happens here. That looks pretty damn good to me, but we can't even use cables, though. That's that's the uh, kicker here. We are officially <laughs> over budget. Oh my god. Okay, so this is obviously not the way to do it, but I'm curious to see if it's gonna even work now. Okay, that is one sexy bridge. Let's see what happens here. Wow, okay. So this is going to test my actual bridge building skills. It's been a while since we've had a level that is just sheer, let's see how good you are with physics, and we'll give you a bridge with lots of money. Now build it and make it damn sturdy. This one's not working, though, so we're going to cut everything off and uh, start from new. So initial ideas is we're going to need some support down below, obviously, because I reinforced the top quite a bit. That's not enough. We want to do something down below. I'm going to go way out here to something like this, do the same thing on the other side, and then just do a typical steel triangle bridge and see what happens. Okay, there's $20,000 in steel right there. We might be over budget here, guys. I'm going to do my best to stay in budget, but uh, if we do go over, that's no big deal. We'll uh, work towards getting it down a little bit. Actually, you know what I'm going to try for right now? We're going to do an uh, under and over bridge hybrid here. We're just going to put this in the middle for right now, and maybe if I can tweak it a bit, we might get lucky and have a sturdy enough bridge here. Okay, just sort this out a little bit. There we go. That actually looks really good, and that doesn't work at all. Fuck. <laughs> okay, I know we're over budget again by a crazy amount. I'm just curious to see. Oh my god, are you serious? How the hell am I gonna do this? Scrap another one, guys. I usually edit this crap out where I'm trying a bunch of different bridges, but you know what? We're gonna keep it in for this one because uh, this is a real struggle here. I'm going to try... Uh, doing a triangle bridge on top of a triangle bridge to the point where I just use all my budget And what I mean by that is basically making triangles on top of triangles. I mean, it's not rocket science Okay, so we spent $52,000 doing the first row, so we're obviously not gonna be able to do another row here um, This is probably you know what? Let's just fucking try we're gonna do a whole row here be way over budget but I just, I'm just curious to see if this works. If it does, maybe we can refine it a bit and uh, make this a little better so that it is in budget. But once, oh man, this is the most expensive one yet. And I don't even think, yeah, that's not even going to work either. God damn it, fuck my life sometimes. Okay, guys, I've been sitting here making straight bridge after straight bridge for at least 40 minutes now. And it didn't even dawn on me that maybe making an archway all the way across with the road will work in the same regard as making an arch bridge with supports. So maybe, just maybe, if we can make some sort of ar arch bridge here, it's going to evenly distribute the weight. I don't really know the physics behind this, but I'm feeling like this is the answer. It's gotta be something like this because everything else is just not working for me. 
Okay, so I'm gonna make this really quickly here. We're just gonna do something like that for right now. And actually, I might do the arch idea again on top. Um, and I maybe even put wood in the middle. It depends on how much budget we have. Let's see if we can do it with just metal here. Because if we can do it with metal, it is always more reinforced. I might even just do a triangle bridge up here if this doesn't work. I don't know what I'm doing anymore, guys. I've tried every strategy that I know of, which are like three. And that's, those aren't working for me. So I don't know where to go from here, really. Uh, you know what? We still got some money. We actually got a lot of money. So let's just do some triangles over here because, well, more reinforcement is generally better. So why not try it, right? Okay, it's very ugly. I don't even know if it's going to work or not, but I'm just testing it out right here. Testing the waters if the arch is the answer. Now, if it, if it can hold all three, essentially that's better than all my other bridges. So let's see what happens here. So far, so good. Everything's green. That sounds good. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay. That actually held it more than the other one. So now I just got to refine this a lot uh, because I did make this extremely quickly and uh, see what we can do here. Okay, we're $10,000, actually $12,000 over budget. Let's just see if it's any better here. Oh, man, that's really red. Yeah, god damn it. Okay, so I hate the, these kind of bridges because it's not so much about thinking and more about just patterns. You need to make these as stable as possible, and I'm not really good at that, can you tell? There comes a time when every bedroom engineer just says, fuck it, and I just need to complete this level. We're getting close. I'm tweaking and tuning, but at this point... I'm not even looking at the budget, guys. I know people hate that, but whatever. I, just, I, I can't. I, I've been at this an hour and a half, and it's still... It, 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 I'm, I'm losing my mind. That's what I'm doing. And as much as I love you guys and your support, my sanity is more important to me. <laughs> Why will you not work for me? I've tried so many bridges, and it's still not even close. The important part is I'm getting further along, and that's giving me drive to keep trying here. But as you can see... <laughs> This is starting to get stupidly complex. I don't care anymore, though. <laughs> I'm out of money, guys. I'm so close. I got like a bridge tumor on top of a damn tumor. I don't even know. What can I take away from this? I don't know what I could take away. You know what? This obviously, this is, this is over the top. I wonder if I can do like something like this and then this let's try that just a smaller bridge tuber come on baby please P fuck you i hate you i hate you you fucking level what i want to know is what sick bastard gives someone a budget of sixty-five thousand dollars to make a fucking 200 foot dump truck bridge come on give me some more money holy shit i'm losing my mind okay you know what we're just gonna delete these because i don't even think they're fucking helping um, and I'm gonna go crazy up here. You know what? We need this. Let's just make the tumor bigger. The bridge tumor is real, guys. Come on, bridge tumor. Don't fail me now. Please. Please. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. What is breaking now? Hold on. I, 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 I'm going to need a replay. Oh, okay. So, you know what? Let's just get rid of these things and turn them all to metal as well. <laughs> this is not how poly bridge is supposed to be, by the way. You're supposed to take your time, analyze, and do it right. I don't give a fuck, though. Come on, please. <gasps> you <sighs> Okay, we're really close, and I, I, I am not playing this smart. Let's try and, you know, stabilize some things here. Let's make this a little better. You know what? The, the, the bigger the expansion is, the more sturdy it is. So let's try something like that. Come on. I'm feeling good about this. Just don't break me, you little, you little red bastard. I hate you. Oh. Oh, stop it. Just stop it, please. <laughs> what do you want from me? What do? You, what more do you want? What are we at? $94,000? Okay, let's just add two more metal beams here. Come on, please. Please. I know you like to turn red and be a little asshole. Oh, that's... Oh, this just isn't working. You know what? More, more tumor. We need more. Fuck, I'm out of money. What if I just really expand this? See what happens here. Something like that. There we go. This should work, right? Oh, this one's red now. There's no fucking way. <gasps> Wait, I lied. Oh my God, we did it. It only took $100,000. Well, $96,778. But it's looking like a lot of people had issues here, judging by these um, histograms. Uh, gonna say that was probably my worst level yet. I don't care anymore, though. Honestly, I'm just happy it's over with and we can move on. Because nobody wants to watch a boring-ass 
bridge anyways, where you just got to do it perfectly. Okay, and next up we got 2x2. Two two. We'll be doing this in the next episode of Polybridge, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Thanks so much for all your support, guys. Thanks for watching and liking, and I will see you in the next one.